Hello everyone friends what we are going to look at in this post today we are going to look at the history of emergence of modern containers in the early days of seaborne trade shipping was carried out in bundles and wooden crates this made it difficult to handle the goods and caused damage to the goods also there were delay in delivery of goods in 1766 james brindley first used 10 wooden boats called starvetiners in coal mining then in 1795 benjamin utrom used wooden wagons for railroads used in coal mines by the 1813s many countries around the world were using these wooden wagons to trade goods by sea land and railroads this is the basic design of modern containers that are used today later in the 80s 40s in england they began to manufacture and use these wagons in iron sheds in the 1900s the closed container box was designed and used in the land and rail transport in 1990 Benjamin Franklin Fitch in United States developed demountable containers out of which 200 containers were used for 21 rail transport and 14 containers for land transport in the same year 1919 an engineer named Rodo Pitts in Poland made the first draft for the container system in 1921 the United States post office contracted to the New York Central Railroad to transport mail via containers. Later, during World War II, many countries in continental Europe began to design and use containers to suit their respective national application. In 1931, Benjamin Franklin Fitch in the United States designed the first two heaviest containers in the world at the time. One 70 feet long, 8 feet wide, 8 feet high and 14,000 kg. Another was 20 feet long, 8 feet wide, 8 feet high and had a capacity of 23,000 kg. These shipping containers were developed and standardized by the military in the United States during the 1940s and 1950s. In 1952, the United States military designed a container system called Connex Box System. They built container 6 feet long by 4 feet wide by 6 feet high. This was stacked in three layers. a large amount of engineering equipment and spare parts were transported through it it is also noteworthy that during the vietnam war 1955 to 1975 excess cargo was transported through this connex boxes then in 1955 malcolm mclean the owner of the formal truck in the united states along with an engineer named keith tanglinger designed intermodal containers that could be used for cargo ships He built 58 container bodies and made the world's first successful container shipping from New Jersey to Texas on April 26, 1956. Thus, from the when iron containers were invented in 1840s to the present day, different types of containers have been used for different types of application. We will see about them in next video. Thank you.